Nick speaking and welcome to this video. Right, another Tyranid learning curve video for you today. More elites and we're going to be looking at the Venom Thropes. So the Venom Thropes, they're 45 points each and you can have between 1 and 3 in a brood. Uh, their weapon skill and ballistic skill 3, strength and toughness 4. They have 2 wounds each, initiative 3 with 2 attacks, their leadership 6 and they have a 5 plus save. And so the leadership six, and they don't have synapse. So you are going to need to synapse creature close by. Uh, which, to be fair, how we're going to use these, that's going to be there anyway. So you don't really have to worry about that. Um, they have some close close combat abilities. They have a lash whip. Uh, they have toxin miasma to use once per game, uh, and they're poisoned. But uh, to poison on a two plus. But to be fair, you're not going to be using them in close combat. Certainly, if you can help it. Uh, what you are going to be doing is taking advantage of their other special rules and that is that they are shrouded so they will have a two plus uh, a plus two to their cover save um, which is very nice indeed so in, if you get a normal five plus cover save piece of terrain you'll have a three plus cover save and of course if you're say in some ruined buildings or maybe behind a defense line that becomes a two plus cover save and that is their main advantage along with the spore cloud special rule so that means um, any models that are within six inches of the Venom Thropes will gain the Shrouded Special Rule. Now if you look at the Shrouded Special Rule, it says that any model within a unit that has the Shrouded Special Rule, the whole unit gains that rule. So even though it's any model within six inches, that actually confers to the whole unit. So it's quite a big bubble um, that you've got there. Um, and that's how I like to use them. Now I usually would take these when I'm using a defence line because it pretty much guarantees you that 2 plus cover save. Um, so what I would tend to have is one or two Venom Thropes uh, behind the defence line with generally uh, Turvigon or some Gants, um, Warriors, you know that type of stuff. Stuff that's going to be scoring, stuff that's going to be some synapse for your main blob and something which is really, really difficult to kill. Yes, there are weapons that ignore cover, um, but a 2 plus cover save, that is awesome. It's so good that your enemy is probably not even going to bother shooting at you. And that is what I've experienced. Now, I used to take two of these guys. Um, I only have two models, to be fair. But I used to take two of these guys. Um, but I've been squeezing more points out of my list recently, and I've been dropping them down to one. And the reason for that is when I was taking two, they were never being touched, never being targeted, because you've got so many other things on the table distracting your enemy, they don't want to target you, and they know if they do target you, you've got that two plus cover save. Uh, it's highly unlikely that you're going to go down very easily uh, with a two plus save, you know, and two wounds, of course. Yes, you might throw some ones here and there. Uh, but most of the time you're probably going to be saving them and that's going to become highly annoying. Um, so yeah, I've, I've dropped down to one recently in my list and it's been working pretty good. Um, now previously, um, I had been taking these guys with my sort of Turvigon, Trigon list. Um, you know, where they were sort of hiding behind Turvigons, hiding behind Trigons. Having two or three of these within... The list, but they used to do lots of other things then. They don't, they, which they don't do now. Now their sole purpose really is to give the rest of your army some cover saves. Um, I would say if I was plodding them along the table, maybe walking them behind my force or mixing them within my gants and gaunts, then I would probably look at taking bigger units. Um, but I think behind the defence line, I think just a single mini is probably absolutely fine, to be fair, from my experience anyway. Um, yeah. So, um, great, great little unit. A great mini to have. Just a single one would do you quite nicely. Um, obviously, if you want more cover saves on the table, you can dot them around the place. Um, like I said, you just have to be a little bit careful, a little bit mindful of weapons that obviously ignore cover. Um, but on the whole, a very good choice, 45 points, minimal investment, and uh, as the elite section is a little bit more open now, let's say, to how it used to be, uh, there's definitely room for venom throats in your army. Okay, that's it for this video, hopefully you enjoyed it, and uh, watch out for the next one.
Thanks for watching.